I'm Yanis, and in tonight's tutorial, I will be showing you how to edit the skirmish team colors, the starting money, and adding the boss general. This is a very easy and beginning level edit to the game. This is very, um, if you're very new, this is definitely an edit you should try out yourself. And you will learn the, the most special technique ever the easiest way to modify this game. The most crucial skill you will ever need is in this tutorial. So if you were playing along with the previous tutorial about how to use the final big in your CSF file, you will have extracted the file to your Command & Conquer General's directory, open up your data file, look for I and I and since we are doing a multiplayer because technically skirmish is really multiplayer you're just going against NPCs versus PCs alright so we want to look for the multiplier text and we want to look for the player template the player template will come in a little bit later because that is how you enable boss to be playable in skirmish so let's go ahead and find the files multiplayer and template and open them this will be as you can see this you can modify all these colors as part of the chat and all that good stuff um, I'm not exactly sure what everything needs here Besides, like, use Shroud, that means uh, Fog of War. Um, so simply, this is all your color choices. In my game, I've added dark variations of the starting colors. I've also added white and black, which I think was in Tiberian Sun. I forget. I mean, it could have been another game, Supreme Commander, possibly. Um... As you want to go all the way down, you'll see that there's the multiplayer color choices and there's the multiplayer starting money choice. It is that easy to modify them. You can put in any number you want. Um, I recommend go just adding a zero to all of them. It's a little bit more fun that way. Um, but you don't have to. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it starts at... 20,000 money and so I start with 2,000 so maybe you want to max it out at 100,000 you know um, I have a heavily modded game so where I have a really hard AI where they build tons of units so this is a grace period for both of us um, so here is the crucial skill just so you know this is the most crucial skill to learn when modifying Command and Conquer games and similar games actually. Highlight what you want to do. So you want to make another color, highlight it, copy it, use Control V, right click it, hit copy, put some space there. I like to hit twice just to keep it a little bit organized. Change the color, let's put it as light black like light black let's just make it uh look spell it that way and you can still do it here light black and then the colors are modified by the rgb scale so you can just google that um and then play with a scale and then just literally copy over these numbers into the appropriate spots some maps have a night settings so you can choose a net color into two or you can just modify the colors you already have here and then you do the same thing if you want more money choices you just copy it and then paste it copy I do two and then paste and then say you want you want to start with two million eight million whatever your desire is as I said, personally, one million is even too much on mine. It is that easy. Remember, copy and paste. Next, we'll be adding Boss General. 
open up player template scroll all the way down to the bottom you will look for player template boss general side boss obvious and down here you'll see playable side this will be no that means it's not playable in skirmish you can however be challenged by general in the challenge feature of generals um, this is a little bit of an advanced technique but you know how you start with one dozer well you can now start with three this is not how it normally is all you gotta do again remember copy and paste and then just change the number from 0 to 1 and then 2 etc etc I don't know how high it goes I never m actually uh, played with it thank you and it's just that easy um, if you have any questions comment below if you have any uh, curiosities feel free to ask and I, I could make a video about it and most of all don't forget to save and of course remember always make a backup file before you do any modifications